Hi, this is a quick video to go over the changes in Jigsaw 5.2.9.6. The first thing I'd like to show you is the historical depth. As you can see, we have here the NASDAQ futures and we can see depth well outside of the 10 that we'd normally see there. And this is because of a new setting we have, show depth history. With this off, you'll just see the regular depth along with the total and as usual the amount of depth is actually defined by your data provider so we'll show that amount of depth and the total if you have that setting off. With the setting on we'll show the history of depth in areas we've moved away from. So that gives you a good idea of where liquidity may be sitting outside of the visible depth. Now we've also introduced bid ask histograms so that you can eyeball the relative differences in depth and these histograms work in both the historical depth history and the non-historical mode. Now we can see, set these histograms on and off in the appearance tab. We just uh, set on and off there. Now if you've got this set on, the high large asks, if you've got them both set on, it will actually just show the ask depth, depth histogram. Uh, obviously it would be confusing if we had both set on. So we can set them on and off uh, for the bid side and the offer side. We'll just uh, show you how it works in the non-historical mode. Okay. Now we've also fixed a couple of issues. We had an issue with Epic not being updated in some cases and also an issue where current trades were being cleared when a trade was moved. So that's all for Jigsaw 5.2.9.6. We're planning to release this on the 7th of August 2015. Thanks.